Hey guys, welcome to SS Unitech. So, see this side, and this is continuous sum of Power BI tutorial. So, today we are going to finish the sales fact table. So, we have made a great progress in our project, and we have created the dim tables, and we have also discussed about the star schema. In star schema, as you can see, we have created this dim address table, then dim item table, dim customer table. So, we have splitted this data into all these dim tables now it's time to create this fact table so how we can create this fact table in real time so go to our power bi desktop and we'll see in the practical so let's get started so this is our project and this is our file so just i want to create a replicate of this so right click on this and here we can create the reference and here we can call this as final so we need to play on this first thing just concentrate on the address so in address we are having all these columns but the joining column is address id so these columns should be removed from this fact table and it will have only one column that is address id so how we can do this here go to on last and here just remove all these we can go to on home ribbon and here we can remove the columns so this column is removed so we can join between the address by using this address id second thing we need to go on this item and we'll concentrate on the item so in the item as we can see we are having the product id so a rest of two columns that is product name and product number should be removed because in the dim product we are having the product name and product number so we can join between the dim product and our final fact table by using this product id so go to on final country sales and here we can see we are having two columns that is the product name and product number so these two columns will be removed so just select these two columns and click on this remove columns so now we are having the product id we can join between this table with the dim product table now we are having this last that is dim customer so in the dim customer we can see we are having customer id and account number and bill to address so we need to get only customer id we don't want to get account number and bill to address in the fact table so here so this is the customer id and this is the account number so we need to remove this column first after that bill to address so remove this column as well so now we are having this final fact table so thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe our channel to get many more videos don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our newly uploaded videos thank you so much